Military and civilian police teams got together for the first annual canine competition, testing on obedience, tactical obedience, and controlled aggression. A total of 16 teams participated, 11 of which were civilians. We've got some capabilities and some training areas that they don't have and vice versa. They've got some stuff that they do that we don't do on a normal basis. And with the two of us getting together and sharing our experiences, sharing our training and our expertise, then we're able to better both our teams along with the civilian teams. The security forces canine teams regularly train with their civilian counterparts, which they find to be valuable experiences. Number one, we're all on the same team. You know, we're in it to obviously fight crime and to keep this whole world that we live in, you know, a safer, you know, a safer place. Us, a community, you know, military, obviously, to keep, you know, America safe. I think it's very important for us to have a bond. No. That bond helps them work together more effectively by improving their knowledge and skill and keeping the community safe. Airman First Class Mariah Williams, Scott Air Force Base, Illinois.